dog is so excited. <laughs> I should really start filming after she gets to spread out. I don't know why. I <laughs> Hold up, y'all. Let me let the kid get her run out. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. That is our choice. You have give the devil his notice. Say, devil, you're alive. I'm going to be happy this day. Hey, Teresa. <laughs> How you doing, girl? Thank you for giving me your time today. God, I thank you for Teresa Brown. My sister, I thank you, God. You know, this is like, what is it? The scripture says, he who does the will of my father is my brother, my sister, and my mother. You showing off my sister, Teresa Brown. <laughs> yes, you are. I can't believe I, I haven't even known you that long. I haven't even met you in person. And we're close. And it's a blessing. Dang, this, my eyeshadow eye shadow don't match. <laughs> <laughs> See, it is blue in here, <laughs> but it's not the, the right shade of blue. I made a fashion faux pas. What you call it? Here come the fashion police. Here they come. The fashion police are coming to get me, y'all. <laughs> Glory to <laughs> Glory to God. Look at this right. I'm gonna pray for you, Teresa. Amen. I'm just being silly for a minute. Look at that sun set. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. God is so good. God is so good. God is so good. He's so good to me. God is so good. God is so good. God is so good. He's so good to me. I'll praise his name. I'll praise his name. I'll praise his name. He's so good to me. Hallelujah, y'all. It's Pastor Elsie John Hall, your pastor Airways, spiritual entertainer, encouraging you to get your exercise on today. I'm feeling better already. Glory to God. How y'all doing? Good. <laughs> Hallelujah. I feel better already, y'all. Just take off running down the street. <laughs> See if it don't lift your spirit so <laughs> listen to your body though don't go too fast don't go too fast if you have you're not in shape but just run do what you can <laughs> your exercise release and releases endorphins it's a scientific fact it's been proven i'm telling you what i know listen to the person that used to suffer from depression really bad really bad oh yeah god is a good god oh yes he is our god is an awesome god he reigns from heaven above with wisdom power and love our god is an awesome god our god is an awesome god he reigns from heaven above with wisdom power and love our god is an awesome god he reigns thank you jesus he reigns hallelujah he reigns 
Oh, our God is an awesome God. Sing with me. Our God is an awesome God. He reigns from heaven above with wisdom, power, and love. Our God is an awesome God. He reigns. Thank you, Jesus. He reigns. Hallelujah, he reigns. Oh, our God is an awesome God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Oh, the Holy Spirit is here. Glory to God. Y'all, the, the Lord inhabits the praises of his children. Do you hear me? You start praising the Lord. You want to feel better? You feel a little blue? Just start thanking God. Just start thanking God. Just say, Satan, you know what? The, the joy of the Lord is my strength. This is, this is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I don't have to feel blue. I don't have to be depressed. I don't have to think about what's wrong in my life. I can think about what's right in my life. I'm still alive and where there's life, there's hope. Hallelujah. In your face, Satan. <laughs> You're not getting a victory today. Not today. Mm -mm. We got to fight, y'all. We are soldiers in the army. We have to fight, although we have to cry. I cry sometimes. We've got to hold up the bloodstained banner. We've got to hold it up until we die. We are soldiers in the army. We have to fight, although we have to cry. We've got to hold up the bloodstained banner. We've got to hold it up until we die. Wait a minute, Sakita. Sorry about that, baby. Wait a minute, y'all. Her little, her little training collar was beeping. <laughs> Sheila says, sing it. <laughs> Thank you, Sheila. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Y'all, y'all, let me tell you something. Our minds are amazing. You know why? Because we are fearfully and wonderfully made. God made us. He didn't make any junk. And when, when, when he say all things are possible with God, think it's, he's talking about our minds too. We, our existence is in our minds. It's, it's, oops, sorry. It's the choices that we make, what we choose to think about, that's the way the victory, that's where we get the victory. We choose to think what we want to. Don't think about, don't, don't think or speak about anything you don't want. Even if don't accept pain, nope, nope, don't accept it. Start changing your mind and your body and stand on the word of God and say, Isaiah 53, 5 says, for he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. And by his stripes, we are healed. That's the present tense. So any symptoms we have, we can rebuke them. We don't have to accept them, y'all. This is what I do. This is what I do to walk in the victory every single day, to be without pain every single day. God's word is true if you believe it. And all you need is faith as big as a mustard seed. That's all you need. Speak to your body. Say you are healed. I am healed through Jesus. I am healed. I accept Jesus' suffering on that cross for me. He didn't just die for my salvation so I could go to heaven. He suffered. So I don't have to. So Satan, you take these lying symptoms and you go back to hell. <laughs> Hallelujah. Y'all, <laughs> it works. You hear me? I ain't telling you what I heard. I'm telling you what I know. You look back, all these, it, my life is my testimony, y'all. I'm on here encouraging that I love you. I love everybody, and I want everybody to be as happy as I am because it's possible. Yes, this bipolar 
psychiatrist used to say I could be the bipolar one spokesperson because <laughs> that's classic symptoms. But with God, he's turned them into superpower. He's turned my, my, my symptoms into a freaking superpower. You hear me? <laughs> Accept who you are. Accept how God made you and ask him to t teach you how to walk in faith. And he will. Tell him that you trust him with your life. Ask him what your purpose is. These are, these are the things that I asked him. And he told me, Jeremiah 33, 3 says, call unto me and I will answer. And I will show you great and mighty things that you know not. I didn't know how to deal with these symptoms, y'all, before. Not without medication. I took medicine for 20 years. 20 years until it made me sick. <sighs> God, all things are possible with God, y'all. All things are possible with God. Woo, glory. That's right, Sheila, present tense. That's right. Teresa said, that's right. Thank you for your participation. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I wouldn't be, if I didn't have anybody to talk to, I couldn't be fulfilling my purpose right now. So Sheila and Teresa, I love y'all. I appreciate, I appreciate y'all. God, I ask that you touch my sisters right now from the tops of their heads to the soles of their feet, Father. God, search their desires of their heart and give it to them, Father. Because you said delight yourself in the Lord and he will give you the desires of your heart. And Teresa and Sheila both know I'm on here. Delight myself in you, Father. That's the only reason I'm on here, y'all. That's the only reason I'm on here. <laughs> Hallelujah. I thank you for letting their dreams come true father i thank you for healing them from any sickness or disease trying to attach yourself to them father i thank you for lifting up their spirits father i thank you for encouraging them father i thank you for giving them the answers that they need tonight father tonight father make it clear to them help them to write a plan and write it down and make it make it plain so a herald can run with it so the angels can take off they waiting y'all the angels are waiting the devil and his Evil spirits are waiting too, and they're gonna see. They wait. One is on this side, one is on this side, and they see what you're gonna speak out your mouth. You're gonna speak life, or you're gonna speak death. If you speak death, those demons are gonna make it happen. If you speak life, the angels are gonna take off because they be on their job. Do you hear me? The angels be working over time. I'm telling you what I know. I'm not telling you what I heard, y'all. Woo! The, the world. Woo! <laughs> Oh my goodness. Woo! Holy Spirit activated, y'all. Holy, Holy Spirit activated. Woo! Y'all, excuse me. Woo! Woo! This gets a little much even for me, okay? <laughs> Y'all, this is new for me, okay? It's like growing every day. The spirit grows a little. It's just been growing more and more every day. And it gets, it's, it's new. <laughs> and I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> Woo! 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 But every now and then, it gets a little overwhelming. I got to kind of jump off. <laughs> <laughs> the ride going too fast. I gotta jump off. Jump off for a minute. Slow down. It just gets too overwhelming for me, y'all. I'm serious. Woo! If you know what it felt like. Oh my gosh. Woo! 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 <laughs> oh, thank you, Sheila. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my friend. I love you. God, I thank you for blessing Sheila and Teresa and everybody that's watching and everybody that will watch later on the replay. I thank you for giving them all the desires of their hearts, Father. I thank you for healing their bodies, Father, from the tops of their heads to the soles of their feet, Father. I thank you for your mercy and your grace. Hallelujah. I thank you for taking all fear, doubt, and disbelief away in the name of Jesus. I bind every spirit of fear right now and I cast it down to hell. I bind fear right now and I cast it down to hell. 
and I loose the peace of God that surpasses all understanding. Just receive it, y'all. Just receive it. <laughs> receive it in the name of Jesus. Woo! 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 Oh, Lord. Excuse me. Woo! Mm, mm, mm. Y'all, I need me a spiritual... Um, Somebody, <laughs> I need somebody on a higher spiritual level of me to give me some directions. Because <laughs> this be getting kind of rough. This be getting kind of rough, man. Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh, Lord, thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm good, y'all. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. But it would be, it would be nice to have somebody on a spiritual level, higher spiritual level than me that's been here and can, you know, like, help me. <laughs> so I don't hurt myself. I don't want to hurt myself. You know what I think? You know, you know who I think it, you know who I think got it going on? He in Baltimore. His, his name, he says, Ray, having 600, his name is Lee Michaels, Reverend Lee Michaels. I noticed something when I, when I would listen to him preach. I listened to how he breathes, right? And, and, you know, people have teased people that preachers that breathe like that say they did, they the asthmatic preachers, right? But I think there's, there, I think that's how he controls the Holy Spirit. Cause he's, definitely anointed. I can feel the Holy Spirit when he's preaching. And he, he takes deep breaths and he and he and he does that, right? <laughs> I wonder I wonder if that's if that's a part of it. If that's a part of it. If, and that's how he can, you know, like go for a long time and preach for a long time. You gotta put a pattern to the breathing or something. I don't know. I'm y'all hear me thinking out loud. Y'all pray for me. Him Pray for me here, please. <laughs> I thank you, Father, for my sisters. I thank you for everybody in my life. I bless, bless you. Bless, bless them all, Father. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, this is Pastor Allison Jones Hall, your pastor, the Airways and Spiritual Entertainer, author of the book Cracks in the Potter's Clay, How I Overcame Bipolar One with Faith. This joy I have, the world didn't give it, and the world can't take it away, y'all. I used to be Sheila's on here. Sheila, no. Sheila see me at my worst. Bipolar episode and, and depression and, 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 and manic. She's seen it all. And she's seen it all. So you can believe the words that are coming out of my mouth. <laughs> I keep it real. I walk in the truth. And um, my book, I believe it'll help you if you're struggling or know somebody struggling with bipolar one. Read my book. It's got so much scripture in it. Okay. And it's definitely for the believer. And it's for somebody who's on the fence too that might help you get on the other side. Come on the side of peace and joy. And, and, and oh, thank you, Jesus. Yes, he is Teresa Brown. Teresa, Teresa from Baltimore. Um, Sheila. Yep. Teresa said, Reverend Lee Michaels is a humble man of God. She love him too. Yep, I love him too. Mm hmm. Yep, 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 yep. Um, so I'm so glad I gave that example too. I'm so glad I gave that example. That's the Holy Spirit, y'all. I don't be rehearsing. You know, I don't be. I don't be rehearsing what I'm gonna say. I never know what I'm gonna say. I didn't even think I had the gusto today, y'all. But I do. I walk by faith and not by sight. I walk by faith, not by how I feel. If the, if I feel the Holy Spirit telling me to go, I'll provide. I get on here. If I don't hear from the Holy Spirit, I won't come on. I won't come on. I won't come on and just say what I want to say. This is not what this is about. This is not about Allison. This is about encouraging people. But I need the Holy Spirit. I need God. I can't do anything by myself. All good things come from God. Anything good out come up, comes out of my mouth is coming from Him. You hear me? Because I am nothing but a shell, a vessel. That's it. 
that's it. Who errs? Who makes who makes mistakes? Who blows it sometimes? But when I mess up, I fess up. That's what we got to do, y'all. Because the only person that's, that's, that's perfect was Jesus. The rest of us, we got issues, okay? We got issues. <laughs> and we got the best thing we can do. And I'm talking to myself. The best thing we can do is focus on our own issues, not on somebody else's issue. Focus on our own issues, not on somebody else's. <laughs> what you laughing at, Teresa? <laughs> what you laughing at? What I say funny? Teresa, cracking up. <laughs> I don't even know what I said. <laughs> What did I say? I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have, well, I'm gonna have to record this anyway, so I'll see see if I can figure out what I said that was that was funny. Cause I'm I'm serious as a heart attack right now. <laughs> Hallelujah, glory to God. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Sorry, y'all. So I gotta. But yeah, we gotta focus on our on our ourselves. Help us, Lord. Oh. Thanks, Teresa. <laughs> oh, she's putting up a heart. <laughs> and she put up this this um chipmunk laughing, going, ha 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 ha. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Oh, thank you, God. Thank you, God. I thank you for my sisters, God. I thank you for giving them the answers that they need this night, Father. I'm depending on you. I'm counting on you. <sighs> I ask all these things in Jesus' name. And it, look, y'all, if you want to want a signed copy of my book, go to www.allisonjohn.com. Um, and you can get Cracks in the Potter's Clay, How I Overcame Bipolar, Bipolar One with Faith in English for $10 or Grietas en la Arcilla de la Forero Como Super Bipolar Uno Con Fe en Español for $10 for $10. Also, and if you want the other book that I'm a part of, that's on my website too. That's that's, that's um other authors. It's called Women of the Power Voice Anthology. You talk about some amazing stories. Oh my gosh, there's some amazing stories of overcoming these women that I co-authored with. That's on my. You can buy that on my website too. And if you want to go to YouTube, I mean, go to Amazon. You can download the the ebook or the audio book for free if you don't have it already. Just, just, um, or you can, or you can buy it if you don't have the money. Download it for free. But if you got the money, I appreciate the support. I'm not, I'm not free. I mean, I'm not rich yet. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> but God provides all of my needs. He provides all of my needs. And I give a book away a day. I haven't given one today. I haven't, haven't seen anybody today. So I'll be putting the offer out here every day. I'll be put, I put the offer out there yesterday. God doesn't hold me to it if I can't control it. I put the offer out there last night that I didn't. I was so tired yesterday. I slept a lot. I didn't get to see anybody. So I didn't give a book to somebody. So what I said in my live last night, anybody watching, just reach out to me. Contact me through my website. Say I want a free book. And I'll send you one. And in whatever format you want. You want an ebook, you want an audio book, or you want a paperback. I'll send it to you. Just send me your address or send me your email. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Because God provides for me, y'all. I love you. Thank you for being here with me. Have a beautiful, God-blessed night.